What is productivity? Getting things done efficiently and well. Why is productivity important? It helps achieve goals and success. How can you manage time effectively? Use a schedule and prioritize tasks. What can you do to stay focused? Remove distractions and set goals. Why is it good to take breaks? Resting helps recharge and refocus. How can you complete tasks faster? Work steadily and avoid procrastinating. What can you do to stay organized? Use folders and labels for everything. Why is it important to be consistent? Consistency helps build good habits. How can you avoid distractions? Find a quiet place to work. What can you do to be more efficient? Use shortcuts and helpful tools. Why is it good to set goals? Goals give direction and motivation. How can you manage time for projects? Break tasks into smaller steps. What can you do to avoid multitasking? Focus on one task at a time. Why is it important to plan ahead? Planning helps avoid last minute stress. How can you track progress? Use a checklist or chart. What can you do to beat procrastination? Start tasks right away and stay focused. Why is it good to ask for help? Others may have good ideas. How can you stay positive and motivated? Think of rewards and achievements. What can you do to complete homework faster? Create a quiet study area. Why is it important to review your work? To catch and correct mistakes. How can you use tools to help you? Use a timer for time management. What can you do to be organized at school? Use folders for each subject. Why is it good to take notes? Notes help remember important information. How can you stay on track with projects? Use a calendar or planner. What can you do to manage distractions? Turn off electronics while studying. Why is it important to stay on schedule? To finish tasks on time. How can you avoid feeling overwhelmed? Break tasks into smaller parts. What can you do to improve focus? Practice mindfulness and deep breathing. Why is it good to set priorities? To focus on important tasks first. How can you use free time wisely? Spend time on hobbies or learning. What can you do to be organized for school? Use a backpack for all supplies. Why is it important to follow directions? To do tasks correctly and safely. How can you plan your day? Make a morning and bedtime routine. What can you do to manage time for play? Balance playtime with responsibilities. Why is it good to help others? Helping makes us feel good too. How can you create a study schedule? Allocate time for each subject. What can you do to finish chores quickly? Work together with family members. Why is it important to keep trying? 
Effort leads to improvement and success. How can you be more organized at home? Have a designated spot for belongings. What can you do to improve focus? Practice mindfulness and deep breathing. Why is it good to set priorities? To focus on important tasks first. How can you use free time wisely? Spend time on hobbies or learning. What can you do to be organized for school? Use a backpack for all supplies. Why is it important to follow directions? To do tasks correctly and safely. How can you plan your day? Make a morning and bedtime routine. What can you do to manage time for play? Balance playtime with responsibilities. Why is it good to help others? Helping makes us feel good too. How can you create a study schedule? Allocate time for each subject. What can you do to finish chores quickly? Work together with family members. Why is it important to keep trying? Effort leads to improvement and success. How can you be more organized at home? Have a designated spot for belongings. What can you do to improve focus? Practice mindfulness and deep breathing. Why is it important to set goals? Goals give us direction and purpose. How can you stay focused on tasks? Remove distractions and take short breaks. What can you do to manage time better? Use a timer and prioritize tasks. Why is it good to have a routine? Routines create structure and reduce stress. How can you stay organized with schoolwork? Use folders and notebooks for each subject. What can you do to improve study habits? Find a quiet place to study and take breaks. Why is it important to practice problem solving? Problem solving helps us find solutions. How can you improve reading skills? Read regularly and ask questions about stories. What can you do to stay motivated in sports? Set personal goals and practice regularly. Why is it good to communicate with others? Communication helps us understand and connect. How can you handle disagreements with friends? Talk calmly and listen to each other. What can you do to be a good teammate? Encourage others and work together. Why is it important to listen to teachers? Listening helps us learn and understand. How can you be respectful to others? Use kind words and show empathy. What can you do to be a good friend? Be supportive and share with others. Why is it good to try new activities? Trying new things can be fun and exciting. How can you be responsible at home? Help with chores and take care of belongings. What can you do to show gratitude? Say thank you and be appreciative. Why is it important to eat healthy foods? Healthy foods help us grow and stay strong. How can you be safe around the house? Don't touch dangerous objects and ask for help. What can you do to be kind to animals? Treat them gently and with respect. Why is it good to practice mindfulness? 
Mindfulness helps us stay calm and focused. How can you handle feeling angry or sad? Talk to someone you trust about your feelings. What can you do to be brave? Take deep breaths and face your fears. Why is it important to be honest? Honesty builds trust with others. How can you help the environment? Recycle and save water and energy. What can you do to be patient? Take deep breaths and wait calmly. Why is it good to learn from mistakes? Mistakes teach us valuable lessons. How can you be a good citizen? Follow rules and help your community. What can you do to show empathy? Understand and care about others' feelings. Why is it important to practice good hygiene? Good hygiene keeps us healthy and clean. How can you be a good role model? Show kindness and make positive choices. What can you do to stay safe online? Don't share personal information and ask for help. Why is it good to share with others? Sharing makes others happy and strengthens friendships. How can you be creative and imaginative? Play pretend games and make up stories. What can you do to be a good listener? Pay attention and don't interrupt others. Why is it important to be responsible with technology? To use devices safely and respectfully. How can you show gratitude to your family? Say thank you and do kind things for them. What can you do to be a good team player? Work together and encourage others. Why is it good to have a positive attitude? Positivity helps us overcome challenges. How can you show respect to your teachers? Listen attentively and follow their instructions. What can you do to stay calm when feeling anxious? Take deep breaths and talk to someone you trust. Why is it important to stay curious and ask questions? Asking questions helps us learn and understand. How can you show kindness to someone who is sad? Offer a hug or a kind word. What can you do to be a good problem solver? Think of different solutions and try them out. Why is it good to be open-minded? Being open-minded helps us learn and grow. How can you be respectful to your classmates? Treat them with kindness and listen to their ideas. What can you do to stay safe outside? Follow traffic rules and always hold an adult's hand. Why is it important to be honest with your parents? Honesty builds trust and strengthens the relationship. How can you be a good leader in a group? Listen to others' ideas and make fair decisions. What can you do to be helpful at home? Offer to help with chores and cleaning. Why is it good to be organized with your belongings? Being organized helps us find things easily. How can you show appreciation to your teachers? Say thank you and work hard in class. What can you do to be a good sport? Congratulate others and play fair. Why is it important to be kind to nature? To protect plants and animals and keep the earth clean. How can you be respectful to your grandparents? Listen to their stories and spend time with them. What can you do to be a good reader? 
Practice reading every day and use the pictures. Why is it good to be patient with your siblings? Patience helps avoid arguments and fights. How can you be safe at the playground? Follow the rules and play carefully. What can you do to be a good helper at school? Offer to pass out papers or clean up. Why is it important to be careful with sharp objects? To avoid accidents and injuries. How can you be respectful to your friends' feelings? Listen when they talk and be supportive. What can you do to be a good team leader? Encourage everyone's ideas and work together. Why is it good to be polite to others? Politeness shows respect and kindness. How can you be responsible with your toys? Put them away and take care of them. What can you do to be a good citizen in your community? Keep the neighborhood clean and help others. Why is it important to be respectful to people of different cultures? Respect promotes understanding and friendship. How can you be safe near water? Never swim alone and follow safety rules. What can you do to be a good helper in the kitchen? Wash fruits and vegetables or stir ingredients. Why is it good to be honest with your feelings? Honesty helps others understand how you feel. How can you be responsible with your school supplies? Keep them organized and don't waste them. What can you do to be a good teammate in sports? Encourage and cheer for your teammates. Why is it important to be kind to animals? Kindness makes animals feel loved and cared for. How can you be safe around strangers? Don't talk to strangers and stay close to a trusted adult. What can you do to be a good communicator? Listen carefully and use clear words. Why is it good to take care of your body? Taking care of your body keeps you healthy. How can you be respectful to your teachers? Listen attentively and follow their instructions. What can you do to stay calm when feeling anxious? Take deep breaths and talk to someone you trust. Why is it important to stay curious and ask questions? Asking questions helps us learn and understand. How can you show kindness to someone who is sad? Offer a hug or a kind word. What can you do to be a good problem solver? Think of different solutions and try them out. Why is it good to be open-minded? Being open-minded helps us learn and grow. How can you be respectful to your classmates? Treat them with kindness and listen to their ideas. What can you do to stay safe outside? Follow traffic rules and always hold an adult's hand. Why is it important to be honest with your parents? Honesty builds trust and strengthens the relationship. How can you be a good leader in a group? Listen to others' ideas and make fair decisions. What can you do to be helpful at home? Offer to help with chores and cleaning. Why is it good to be organized with your belongings? Being organized helps us find things easily. How can you show appreciation to your teachers? Say thank you and work hard in class. What can you do to be a good sport? Congratulate others and play fair. Why is it important to be kind to nature? To protect plants and animals and keep the earth clean. 
How can you be respectful to your grandparents? Listen to their stories and spend time with them. What can you do to be a good reader? Practice reading every day and use the pictures. Why is it good to be patient with your siblings? Patience helps avoid arguments and fights. How can you be safe at the playground? Follow the rules and play carefully. What can you do to be a good helper at school? Offer to pass out papers or clean up. Why is it important to be careful with sharp objects? To avoid accidents and injuries. How can you be respectful to your friends' feelings? Listen when they talk and be supportive. What can you do to be a good team leader? Encourage everyone's ideas and work together. Why is it good to be polite to others? Politeness shows respect and kindness. How can you be responsible with your toys? Put them away and take care of them. What can you do to be a good citizen in your community? Keep the neighborhood clean and help others. Why is it important to be respectful to people of different cultures? Respect promotes understanding and friendship. How can you be safe near water? Never swim alone and follow safety rules. What can you do to be a good helper in the kitchen? Wash fruits and vegetables or stir ingredients. Why is it good to be honest with your feelings? Honesty helps others understand how you feel. How can you be responsible with your school supplies? Keep them organized and don't waste them. What can you do to be a good teammate in sports? Encourage and cheer for your teammates. Why is it important to be kind to animals? Kindness makes animals feel loved and cared for. How can you be safe around strangers? Don't talk to strangers and stay close to a trusted adult. What can you do to be a good communicator? Listen carefully and use clear words. Why is it good to take care of your body? Taking care of your body keeps you healthy.